Hey guys, Judson here with Save Our Shores Florida. Um, I have just gotten back from a trip along the Gulf Coast uh, documenting some of the continuing effects of the oil spill uh, as well as doing some acid rain testing. Um, this trip was from the 18th through the 20th. Uh, we collected samples from six locations uh, from Florida uh, to western Mississippi. Uh, and today we're going to look at the results of the tests and uh, see what we can find. Uh, we're going to start over here. Um, I have got uh, one of our jars filled with distilled water, uh, which should have uh, an industry standard between 6.8 and 7.2 on the pH scale. Uh, so it should be pretty pure water. Uh, it should be a, a neutral pH. Uh, and we're going to test our, our strips just to make sure uh, that they're accurate. Um, and if you guys want to see, this is the strips I'm using by Indigo Instruments. Uh, it goes from a 4 to a 7 on the pH scale. Uh, hopefully we don't see anything lower than a 4 here today. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and start with the distilled water and uh, see what the results are here. And the instructions say to hold it in there for about two seconds uh, to test. So there's the first strip. Um, come back a very dark blue. Uh, as you can see on the scale here, uh, that's going to be a 7. Uh, so that's exactly what we'd expect. Uh, the, so the distilled water came back as a 7. Um, that's perfect. Uh, so we're going to go to our first location uh, here in Florida. Uh, the first spot that we left a, a collection uh, jar was in Destin. Uh, and just so you guys know, uh, because of cars and, and even trees give off stuff, uh, naturally rain in the area is going to be around a 5.6 on the pH scale. Uh, anything lower than a 5.6 is going to be slightly acidic to acid rain. Uh, but a 5.6 is nothing to be concerned about. It's pretty common in the area. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and do the first test. This is Destin. We're going to look at this. Sort of a medium green color. It, um... sort of between these two, around 5.6 on the scale. So Destin's really exactly where we would expect it to be. I'm going to go ahead and write these down uh, so we can remember. So it's a 5.6 for Destin. Uh, a little farther down the state, Pensacola is going to be our next sample. And Pensacola, a little bit lighter than Destin. Not a whole lot, uh, but that's a 5.2 here. So slightly acidic, just very slightly. Um, nothing to be really too concerned about, but it is slightly acidic. Uh, so we're going to move over to Alabama, uh, and our first sample comes from uh, Orange Beach. Take our sample from Orange Beach, and let's look at this. Again, that's kind of a light color. I would say it's actually between the 4.8 and the 5.2 there. Um, I'm going to call that around a 5. Again, slightly acidic. Not, not really extremely at all, but slightly. And move down the beach just a little bit to Gulf Shores. And let's see what we've got here. Well, that's looking a little bit more on the yellow side. It's still sort of green. I think it's closer to a 4.8, but uh, that's moving down there. You guys can see it's it's not quite yellow, but it, it's a light green. And that's a 4.8 right there. So we're seeing a little bit of 4.8 to 5.0 in Alabama. Uh, some slightly acidic rain there. And finally, we're going to look at our last two samples from uh, Mississippi. Get a strip ready here. All right, let's 
to Gulfport. Alright, let's look at the results on this one. Looks like Gulfport is again uh, around the same as we saw in Alabama, uh, right at a 4.8. So again, we still have some slightly acidic rain uh, the farther west we're going here. And uh, the storm that we're measuring this rain from came in off the Gulf, uh, blew over southern Louisiana and then westward uh, over Mississippi, Alabama, and Florida. Uh, so expecting most of these samples to be about the same. Past Christian's a little bit farther down the beach from Gulfport. Just going to check just to verify uh, the Gulfport sample against this one. And uh, again, still a 4.8. So uh, it's looking like the rain in the region is slightly acidic. Uh, we are seeing some acid rain. Um, not so much in Florida. Uh, Florida is still in the fives. Uh, so it's, it's close to where we would expect the rain uh, pH to be, but uh, Alabama and Mississippi, as you guys can see, slightly acidic rain. To find out more about acid rain and to learn more about the samples that we took here, you should visit us on the web at www.sosfla.org. That's sosfla.org.